Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back for episode number... what is this? God, what a blank. 25? I think this is episode 25, right? Yeah, episode number 25 of our Pokemon Fool's Gold Nuzlocke. And you can tell I'm a bit frazzled, I'm a bit in a weird mood, my head kind of spins. Uh, in the previous episode, we took on the first two Elite Four, so we are... Today, hopefully, we're gonna make it to the champion. Let's see what happens, because we are very underleveled. Our team is... Our level 44 Espeon versus the Espeon bug type with Fly, Silver Wind, Hidden Power, and Cut. Kind of a uh, one trick pony, not gonna lie. Kind of wish it could do something more, but whatever. Then we have Cookie, the Lantern, Water Dark type, uh, with holding the Black Glasses with Hidden Power, Waterfall, Crunch, and Surf. Then we have Lullaby, the Ghost Ground type Ampharos, holding the Quick Claw with Shadow Ball, Earth Power, Strength, and Ice. Punch, and then then we have rather not. I was gonna say and lastly, but anyways, grass and fire type planter the Venusaur, Mir holding the Miracle Seed with Razor Leaf, Hidden Power, Growth, and Ember. I don't know that we know what that Hidden Power is. Then we have the third, our Psychic Ice type Suicune, holding the Never Melt Ice with Barrier, Amnesia, Neptune Wind, and Confusion. And lastly, we have Nunchaku, our Fighting type Megadium, holding the Amulet Coin for with Dynamic Punch, Strength, Reflect, and for Sight. So, it's Bruno time, right? Yeah, we defeated Koga, we defeated Will, so now it's Bruno time. How do you fight... Let's see, so fighting types. Fighting types are really bad for our team versus resist fighting, which is why we put it up front. I can kind of imagine him starting with a Hitmontop, but Verse... Oh yeah, Verse has Fly. If he were to start with a Hitmontop, it's a grass type in this game. Fly would be very good. Let's just lead with Verse and see what happens. I think that's actually okay. We resist his stab, so... I am Bruno. No, what voice to give Bruno? I am Bruno. No, I don't. I don't know. I am Bruno of the Elite Four. I always trained to be the to the extreme because I believe in our potential. That is how we became strong. Can you withstand our power? I hate the voice I gave him. Um, I see no fear in you. You look determined, per perfect for battle. Ready, Tigus? You will bow down to our overwhelming power. Hoo ha! I hate the voice I gave, I wasn't even really a voice, it's just my voice, but deeper. It's fine. Barely even deeper. I stabbed myself in the face the other day. Not really, I just hurt myself, but like... It's all puffy and ugly looking, it's a shame. Anyways, we for Bruno, we're not gonna- Jump Love? Wait. Wait, Jump Love is a fighting type? I gotta test this, right? It's either a, f either a fighting type or a bug type. I oh, sorry, a ground type. Either way, either way, I can't speak today. Either way, Bug has the upper hand here. Let's try the Silver Wind. Cause, yeah, originally he has two Onyxes, right? Instead of just a full team of fighting types, so this isn't even a fighting type. Okay, so, I, I, I really like Jump Wolf in this game, so ground fight, it's just a giant potato, but sure. Fuck it. Leech Seed, okay. Gonna speed this up a little. Oh, never mind. Sorry, if I just Silver Wind, he dies, right? So that's good. Why'd they give Silverwind 10 PP, but not Dynamic Punch? Does Dynamic Punch still only have 5 PP? Probably, Inferno only has 5 PP. Okay, jump off down, good lead, good lead. Alright, what are you sending out? Politoed. Have we- okay, Poliwag is a ground type. So, let's stick to the logic. Is it gonna be a ground and fighting type? Yeah, Verse can't really cover that. Let's go- ground and fighting is weak to grass. We could go Planter, we could go Cookie. We could go Cookie, we could go Planter, Ground Fighting. Ground Fighting Politoed, I'm, I'm actually really curious. So Poliwrath isn't a fighting type, but Politoed is. We could go the third, Ground Fighting. Wouldn't be too bad, but let's just, let's just play it safe and go... Let's go Cookie, Cookie takes hits the best. Oh my god, I love that! What the hell? That's gotta be Ground Fight, that kind of looks like it would be a fighting type, right? But it's kind of Claydolly. Might be a water type, um, not a water type, a psychic type? That would be dope. Well, either way, we're gonna surf. No matter what, surf should be super effective here. We could have crunched if it were a psychic type, but... Alright, super effective. So it's definitely still a ground type from that polywag. It got O-code. Okay, I did not expect that. I mean, huh. I mean, maybe it's the stats are just not that good? I mean, polito has got pretty good special defense. Maybe rock? No, I don't think it would be rock. Wait, he just said Poliwrath, right? Okay, so now it's ground fighting. 
I just realized I sent out a fucking dark type of against the potential gra- What am I doing today? My mind is not here. Okay, let's go planter against this potential fighting type. You look dope! You look dope, you're just kind of a mud polyrath, but okay, yeah, he's definitely gotta be fighting type then, right? He's gotta be fighting type, so let's just Razor Leaf, see how much damage we do. I don't think we'll do 50%. We need something better than Razor Leaf on Planter, like, come on. Enough's enough, you know? Yeah, okay, crit. We got a crit, so that did 50%. Sets up the Sandstorm, interesting, interesting. For sure. For sure, for sure, I can dig it. Sandstorm does a lot of damage in this game. Alright, Razor Leaf it up. I don't think it'll kill, though, which is really unfortunate, because it'll put it in range for a potion. It might kill. Okay, oh my god, another crit! Holy fucking Christ, Pot! Yes! Okay, Planter! Cool. Cool. Alright. About to use a Steelix. We've seen Steelix, haven't we? It's, isn't it like... It's poison... Ground, right? Ground poison? What the fuck? Why does... Is Bruno a... Wait. Is he... Did they convert him into a ground-type trainer in this game? I guess they did. Polyrath, Politoed. Yeah, every Pokemon he's had so far is a ground type. So he's a ground type trainer in this game? I don't love that. Alright, poison and ground. I mean, my my instincts are just telling me to go into the third. Because special defense isn't that great on Steelix. But I'm afraid we're gonna take a big hit. Like, we're we we're super effective on him. Ooh, he's level 47. Okay. We're super effective on him with both our stabs. Oh right, the sensor. Ugh, I don't like that. So he's a fucking Bruno's a ground type trainer. I honestly I really don't like that. I really don't like that. They didn't change any other one's typing, I hope. At least not the first two. I don't- why is Bruno a, f a ground type trainer? It's not- he's not a fighting type trainer. I don't like that at all. Yeah, okay. Neptune win, just O-code because it's a fucking Suicune and that's a Steelix. Sounds about right. And then Mr. Mi- Mr. Mime? Mr. Mime? Wait. Mr. Mime? We've seen Mr. Mime. Haven't we? I don't know why Mr. Rhyme just comes to mind. Well, if it is a psychic- uh, if it is a, a ground type... I mean, I want to- let's just go up to Planter. Mr. Mime's special defense is a lot better than his physical defense. That's a ground type? Ground steel, I guess? Okay, let's see if he gets hit. He didn't get hit, so, he's, so he must be a ground type. Ground steel type Mr. Mime. I mean, I really like what they've done with it. Okay, it's not steel type, because that was super effective. I nearly went for Ember. Yeah, we've definitely seen this thing before, but I can't remember at all what its typing is. Ground Rock, maybe? Alright, Sandstorm. It's a bit risky, because if it's a Speed Tie, we lose Planter here. So let's actually heal up. Because a crit will not kill us, I believe. So let's just heal up Planter. 1 away HP. Nice, nice, nice. And then, yeah, take another Earth Power. Earth Power of Mr. Mime, though. That actually sounds pretty fun. That actually sounds pretty fun. Although Psychic is a better offensive typing than Ground. Although Ground is very good as well, of course. Alright, now we should be faster. Let's just Ember it up. Cool. I mean, this will definitely kill. We need to check the typing on, like, half of those Pokemon, for sure. Like, what the fuck just happened? Togetic. Togetic is definitely a, a ground type, but I remember it looking like a dragon type. I think, as I recall, that it's a pure dragon type. Uh, pure pure ground type, rather, but... Level 48, so his ace was Poliwrath, I believe? As I, as I recall? Something like that? Level 49? That's not too bad, actually. Let's just Neptune win the fuck out of it. I mean, we have a Suicune. Why not, why not level it up? Before we have to deal, you know, Ice type Suicune, before we have to do- Oh, I did not mean to speed that up. With, uh, with Lance and his dragons. And down goes Togetic, and down goes Bruno. They reworked Bruno as a ground type trainer. I- I guess? Sure? I mean, I, again, I really don't like that. I hope they didn't rework the- the dark type Elite Four. Having lost, I have no right to say anything. Go face your next challenge. Yeah, shut the fuck up. You're not even fighting type in this game for some reason. Alright. Hyper Potion it up. Who needs a Hyper Potion? Planter needs a Hyper Potion. Do we have anything short of a Hyper Potion to use here? Dragon Fang, we don't have any Dragon types. Mercandy, Elixir, Full Restore. Nope, okay. Well, let's just Hyper Potion. Nope. I was about to say, don't waste it. Uh, sure, make sure everyone is at full health. Okay. Whew, Bruno down. Bruno down. Claire, right? That's her name. I just no. Claire is the, who is this one? I can't remember her name, at all. Bruno is down. She is a dark type gym leader though, or elite four, and we have a Meganium. Off the top of my head, I can't think of any. If she has a fucking Tyranitar, I'm gonna that that is actually gonna be a problem. 
So that is actually going to be a problem. She has a Tyranitar. Let's just lead my... <sighs> Our only fighting type move is, is, is Dynamic Punch. Let's lead... Let's lead... Um, let's lead with Verse. I think that makes sense. I actually think that makes sense. Let's lead with Verse and save Nunchaku for... If the time comes. Karen. Of course, she's a Karen. I shouldn't know. <laughs> Can I speak to your manager? I am Karen of the Elite Four. You're Tegas. How amusing. I love dark type Pokemon. I find their of course the fun way dark typing is a mistranslation from Japanese in which it's evil typing. Of course Karen would be the fucking evil typing. I find their wild, tough image to be so appealing, and they're so strong. Think you can take them? Just try to entertain me. Let's go. I have to every time. Karen's on they always always. Alright, let's do this. Elite for Karen, what you got? An Electabuzz. Okay, that is just a pure dark type, as I recall. We forgot to check the typings of the- I want to see Politoes typing, above all else, because it shouldn't have died to that. Silver Winded Up. Come on, Verse, Silver Winded Up. When are you going to learn Bug Buzz, buddy? I know Bug Buzz is in this game, because we got Bug Buzz last episode. Okay, that didn't kill. But we got this fucking stop- Oh, are we about to sweep with Verse? Are we about to sweep with Verse? Defense Sharp, we fell. Fuck it. Uh... She might heal. No, okay. Hidden Power is Bug. We actually got Hidden Power Bug, which I guess isn't terrible, it's a special hit- it's a special Silver Wind. So, why not? Why not? I mean, if we ever run out of PP on Silver Wind, we have Hidden Power. Blissey? Wait, Blissey? Right, Chansey was a Dark-type, wasn't it? Just pure Dark? I feel like it wasn't pure Dark. But I- I mean, Nunchaku's still our best bet, because, you know, it's a Blissey. Oh my god, look at Blissey! I love that. I actually love that with the fucking- That is so cool! That should be an actual Pokemon. That should be like a Blissey regional variant. It genuinely should with the fucking bolt of like, ram's horns and shit, the broken egg. That is dope. That is fucking dope. Well, miss number one, we get sludge bombed. Took a bunch of damage and got poisoned. Alright, we're, we're gonna full- uh, We're gonna full restore here. We only have five, but we're nearly at the champion. And I don't want to lose him Chaco. <laughs> I really don't. Okay, you light you light screen up. That does fuck all. Is this her, her ace? Is her ace really level 51 Blissey? Yes! Connected dynamic punch. Good. That should do at least... That might kill. It's super effective, right? It's gonna be super effective. It's a dark type. It might kill without being super effective as well, but okay, no, it doesn't. Wait, it wasn't super effective. What fucking typing? What resists... What resists fighting in this generation? It's definitely not a bug type. Is it a poison type? Do we have a dark poison type fucking Blissey in the game? Is that a good typing? Yeah, it's only weak to, to ground, right? That's dope. Alright, let's strength it up here. Good, Nunchaku. Good, you fucking... Yes, connecting that clutch dynamic punch. Good. Oh, that's so dope. Okay, that's, that's dope. That's dope. About to use a lantern. Okay, so we know that thing's typing at least. Uh, let's go... let's go Planter. Lantern's special defense is better than their physical defense, otherwise I would go into... probably Verse or something. But let's go Planter here, because we do have Razor Leaf, unfortunately, but... At least in this case, it's a phys physical move. Our entire team is special. Except Nunchaku. So, you know, having a physical move here is at least something. Okay, 50%, that's respectable. Crunch. That's gonna hurt. Oh, that did nothing. Oh, that did absolutely fuck all. Okay, get off my screen, what the hell? Level 51 Blissey, so is Lance going to be level 53 or level 55? Okay, Lantern goes down. Yes, good, 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 good. Fuck yeah. Okay, okay. Alakazam. Pure dark type, as I recall. At least Kadabra was. Alright, if Kadabra was of pure dark type, we could go back out to Nunchaku. But if it gains psychic typing for whatever reason, that could be really bad. Pure dark type. I guess verse... We're phys physically, oh, sorry, we're spe yeah. specially bulky and fast. Alakazam looks amazing, holy shit. What the fuck? Oh, the, the, the light screen ran out as well, that's great. What the fuck though? It looks like Osiris. Holy shit, I want one now. Like, I actually really want one. Did it actually just die to Silverwind? We got a crit. That is so fucking cool, I want one. We yeah, we don't even have a dark type in the PC. Fuck it. I want an Alakazam. That looks dope. We have an Abra, don't we? We definitely have an Abra. We can get an Alakazam. That's so fucking cool. I didn't see what he was sending out. Um, I guess it's staying with Verse. It's a bit dangerous. Sand Slash. Oh, normal and dark, right? Yeah, we could have totally gone out, but... 
it's a sad slash in this game. It's this game's Raticate. I mean, if it, if it didn't look so much like Lucario, I would probably actually like it. But it looks way too much like Lucario to not be a steel type, in my opinion. So, I mean, I still feel bad for Snort, but I really like Snort. But, I don't know. And then last Pokemon in the game, Hound Houndoom is right, right, right. Houndoom is grass dark, isn't he? Well, I mean, that's just an easy that's just an easy kill with Verse, though. So that's not bad. Let's just let's actually save the PP on Silverwind and Hidden Power here. Because, I mean, we'll have to do this again at the end of uh, Kanto before we take on Red. So we may as well save our Ethers and Elixirs for then, if we can. Down goes the Houndoom. Dope. Dope. That was cool. Fuck yeah. All right. We're on the level, but it doesn't seem to matter. Good stats and good typing. Uh, that's all. That's what we're doing here. Fuck yeah. Um, a strong Pokemon. Weak Pokemon. That is only the selfish perception of people. I'm a Karen. I know best. I did that. Came out wrong. Truly skilled trainers should tr try to win their favorites. With their favorites. I like your style. You understand what's important. Yeah, my favorite is definitely a fucking Suicune. To be fair, though. It might be it might be a better redesign than Lugia. I might prefer Suicune to Lugia. For sure I do, even. I, I can see it on the layout. For fucking sure I do. Go on. The champion is waiting. Oh, I didn't know that we were going to make it to this point in today's episode. Champion time. Fuck, I'm, I'm nervous. Okay, I'm fucking nervous. Let's, let's do this. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. What is he going to lead with? A Gyarados, maybe? Gyarados is... I mean, traditionally leads with a Gyarados. That's a ground and ghost type. And um, ground and dragon type. I wonder if he's going to have six dragons. I have to, right? I have to lead with the third. How are we doing on PP? How are we doing on PP? Eight Northern wi Neptune wins, that should be plenty. Seven crunches only. Ugh. How did I go through so many crunches? Can't remember. Probably against the poison type guy or something. The rest seems fine though. Lullaby, Qu Shadow Ball, yeah, I barely touched Lullaby. We don't use Lullaby much, but when we do, it's really good. It has Ice Punch, I gotta keep that in mind, it does have Ice Punch. Razor Leaf, Hidden Power, Growth Ember, that's fine. Silver Wind is a little in that, but I don't see us using five Silver Winds. Three Dynamic Punches could be rough, but I don't want to waste any items. Ooh, I don't know that we'll even be able to save in front of lands. I have never made it to the Elite Four in a Gen 2 game. Ever. Like, just straight up ever. I've seen my friend do it once, when I was like four or six. Oh, yeah, we don't. Oh, no, we do. This is intense. Look at the fucking Dragonair statues. Were they always Dragonair statues? That's dope. That's fucking dope. What is happening? Okay. That was that was concerning. Oh, guys, moment of truth. Put in the comments right now. Are we going to succeed? Are we going to fail? Are we going to get our ass whooped by the Dragon Master himself? The fucking music is about to hit so hard. I've been waiting for you. Tigas, I knew that you, with your skills, would eventually reach me here. There's no need for words now. We will battle to determine who is the stronger of the two of us. As the most powerful trainer, and as the Pokemon League champion, I, Lance, the Dragon Master, accept your challenge. Bum, bum, doo -doo -doo. I'm excited. I'm fucking, I'm terrified, but I'm excited. I'm Fortress? Fortress? What the fuck is this? Fortress is a dragon type or Fortress is just really fucking good? What is this shit? Oh no. What the fuck? Did they complete? They, they, they have to have reworked Fortress's stats. Yeah, that should not have done that much damage coming from a regular Fortress. They must have reworked Fortress's stats. Okay, taking that damage on. They must have also. Fortress wouldn't be that fast. What the fuck is this? I actually love that. They completely reworked Fortress's stat. That is dope. That is a cool fucking design. It turns from like a, a bagworm into this shit. That is dope. And Lance has one of the bug types. That's fucking cool. And it did good work, honestly. Like, I'm now a little worried because I can't just send out the third against anything anymore. About to use a Wobbuffet. Wait. He doesn't have just dragons. Okay. Wobbuffet, though. What are we doing with the Wobbuffet? So it's a Psychic and Fighting type, right? So what is that actually weak to? It's a really good typing combination. It's weak to Ghost. It is weak to Ghost. Unfortunately, we, do no, long we no longer have Nightshade. 
Weak to Ghost, weak to Flying, so we could fly with Verse, although I feel like that's just a bad idea. Let's go Lullaby. It's a shame we don't have light Nightshade anymore. But let's try to strength it first. Actually, you know what? No, let's take this opportunity and heal up, because it's a Wobbuffet. It can't touch us unless we touch it. So let's take this opportunity and heal up the third here. Let's heal up the third. So we can bring him back in, because we're gonna need that. Well, he's not gonna have Dragonites, is he? Alright, so he's going for Mirror Coat, so let's go for Strength. Because he should still go for Mirror Coat, then we won't take damage. And then Shadow Ball might kill. Yeah, okay, that did nothing. Went for Mirror Coat. I wonder if he'll go for s Counter this turn, because we went for Strength. I'm gonna click Strength again, because I want to test what the AI does. Still going for Mirror Coat. Okay, well, I'm gonna put him in 50% range then before I use Shadow Wall. Because after he's in 50%, a super effective Shadow Wall from an Ampharos. I mean, he's three levels ahead of us. Ooh, Destiny Bond. Okay, that's something to look out for as well, for sure. But there's no way, there's no risk of killing him from this range with Strength, so let's just do that. The animation of Desti Bo Destiny Bond is really deceiving, because it makes it look like if you kill the thing. Uh, like, with a different Pokemon, like, it, it seems like it's an effect placed on Lullaby here, right? But it's not. It's weird. Um, we can't waste a turn. Not really. Not really. We have three rare candies. Why didn't I use them? Oh, that's dumb. Why didn't I use them? We don't really have a way to waste a turn. Because, uh, I mean, I would use a... We don't have any berries. Yeah, no, this is a little rough. I don't want to kill I think it's a crit strength might kill it. I'm gonna Ice Punch. Okay, a crit, a crit of that would have killed for sure. Alright, now he, we are no longer Destiny Bonded, let's just Shadow Ball it and call it a day. That was that was rough. My heart stopped when the I thought we'd gotten a crit, and I thought we were gonna kill it when like we brought it to red. Okay. Okay. That's good. He has a Tyranitar. Oh no. Okay. Here's the problem. Here's the problem. Also, he hasn't had a dragon type yet. The Master of Dragons hasn't had a dragon type yet. Here's the problem. Tyranitar is a dark and ghost type. Tyranitar doesn't have weaknesses. Planter doesn't have Leech Seed. I don't think. And I can't check. Cookie resists both his stabs. I think we go out to Cookie. Look how awesome it is! It has all these eyes! It's a fucking demon! Okay, I love that. I actually my, I actually am in love with that. I want this thing on our team so bad. We can't lose here. Oh my god, it's level 55. We're so fucked. We're faster. Let's try to flinch it, I guess. Oh, we are so fucked. Scary face. We're not faster anymore. <laughs> okay. That's really fucking spooky. I don't like that shit. Ah, oh, yes, Thrash. That's gonna hurt. He's 10 levels above us. He's gonna get himself confused, though. That nearly did 50%. I don't think I risked the crit. I don't want to lose. I don't want to lose. Uh, you know our Pokemon here. I don't think that makes it makes sense to lose our Pokemon. Even if chances are we're gonna box him. Right. We do have a Dark type we want to put on the team. We want to put that fucking thing on the team. So we take out Cookie and Lullaby after the Elite Four theoretically, and put Tyranitar and Lugia on the team. That would be dope. I'd be down for that. Ah. Okay. Another one might still kill, but we're gonna still go for the Hyper Potion here. Like, sorry, we probably would live, but if he gets a crit, we would die. So he's about to get confused. We're gonna try to piggyback right off of that. There's no abilities in this game. Why is he not confused? Okay, now he's confused. It just didn't say he was confused. Okay. Alright, we're cheesing the final boss with potions. I know, I know, but like, can you fucking blame me? Let's try Surf. Let's see if that does more damage. Oh my god, this Pokemon is so dope. Look, there's a shit shooting out of its chest. The shit shooting out of its chest. It's so dope. It's so cool. It's so dope. We won't make the switch to our team immediately, by the way. Be mainly because I don't want to grind between recording this episode and the next, and I am definitely going to record these back to back. Oh, he has full restores. <laughs> Why wouldn't he? <laughs> Why wouldn't he have full restores? Alright, we're speeding this up a little bit. Oh, we got a crit! Fuck yeah! Okay, and we know we live a crit as well, because he, he got a relatively high roll when he brought us nearly to 90, and he would need to be able- Oh, he got a crit. We live a crit, though. I thought we weren't going to for a second. <laughs> okay, that's fine. See, that's why we heal. <laughs> that right there, that is why we heal. Alright, T-Tar. Come on. This is fucking dope. This is this. 
This is a true champ. You can't just ice type. I thought I was gonna just ice type cheese my way through this, but he actually has a fucking T tar. He should be a dragon type. If he's seriously, again six health. Okay, that's that's some fucking rolls we're messing with right now that I do not like. Okay, he should be confused now, but we are definitely not risking it. I don't want to lo lose Cookie like that. Mainly, well, not mainly, but partially because I don't want to. Partially because I don't know that anyone else on my team can even take on this T-Tar, and also because I don't want to have to grind up a new a new member for the team between episodes here. I'll do that for the next time. So we'll, we will swap out Cookie and Amphora and uh, Lullaby soon. Just because typings match with Lugia and uh, T-Tar there. Octil- have we seen Remer- oh no, yeah, Octillery is the, the virus, right? It's a poison type. Okay, well, why do you have a po- why- where are your dragons? Why does the Dragon Master not have dragons? I don't like that so far, honestly. Though 53 Octillery, why though? I vaguely recall him having an Octillery, but I don't think he did. He had so many poison types. Where is this- is he not even gonna have a Gyarados? Like, it's even a dragon type in this game. Is he actually not gonna have a Gyarados? That did nothing. Uh, Confusion and Neptune Wind do the same amount of damage, so... Oh, well, we, we landed it. I don't think he can really touch us. And, you know, and before he pulls out, like, fucking Steel-type Explosion or some shit. Toxic. Okay, this is what we're doing. Okay, to Toxic stall for the last Pokémon. Well, we landed two Confusions and have to minimize, so suck a dick. Fuck you, Octillery. Get the fuck off the screen. That's, that's really what we're doing. Poison. Poison shit, really. About to use a Skarmory. Wasn't that some weird ass like rock and ice type combination? Let's go Nunchaku for that. We haven't used Nunchaku yet. I like that a lot though. That that is fucking that is the spider the, the spider. That is the the snake wrapped around the world in Nord mythology. I love that. Okay, miss miss number one Nunchaku um Nunchaku misses dynamic punch number one. Can you connect Ice Shard? You used agility only to use Ice Shard. Interesting that Ice Shard is in this game though. Alright, can you connect? Thank you. There we go. Landed the third dynamic punch, down goes Skarmory. Honestly, dynamic punch on Nunchaku isn't even that bad, because Nunchaku is kind of bulky, and fighting type is actually pretty reasonable defensively. Like, it's not good, but it's not bad. Zen Headbutt. You know what? Yeah. We will 1000% get rid of Foresight for Zen Headbutt. We've had Foresight way too long, now we actually have coverage, and we have something other than dynamic punch and strength. So that's good. Zen Headbutt's in this game though. Ampharos. You're fucking kidding me, he didn't have a single... Not a single dragon type. I feel fucking cheated. Let's go planter, but I feel fucking cheated. That's just, that's just, that, that's not okay. You can't give Lance no dragon types. He says he's the dragon master. At least change his text. Right? I mean, I mean, right? I think I'm right. Got a crit on the Amphrus, really magnitude instead of earth power, you get earth power so much earlier. Which is why he doesn't have it, but still. Alright, off my screen. Amphrus goes down. That is very disappointing, actually. The T-Tar was really fucking cool. The T-Tar was like a great boss, but he should have had a Gyarados. I... I mean, just Charizard, even though it's not a, a dragon type in this game. Uh, a fucking Muck, even. Anything. Anything that's a dragon type in this game. A Flareon, you know? Like... Where was his, where were the dragon type masters as dragons here? Like, I don't know. It's over. But it's a not feeling. I'm not angry that I lost. In fact, I feel happy. Well, yeah, go put together a better team. I'm not reading his text. Because, I mean, I have to. It's the end of the game, but still. <sighs> you have become truly powerful, Tegas. Your Pokemon have responded to your strong and upstanding nature. As a trainer, you will continue to grow strong with your Pokemon. Oh, no, it's all over! Professor Oak, if you weren't so slow... Professor... Oh, uh... Ah, Tigas! It's been a long while. You certainly look very impressive. The conquest of the League is just... fantastic. Your dedication and trust and love to your Pokémon made this happen. Your Pokémon were outstanding, too. Because they believed in you as... I, I don't know what voice I'm giving him right now. As a trainer, they persevered. Congratulations, Tigas. Let's interview the brand new champion! Can you not? This is getting to be a bit too noisy. Tigas, could you come with me? Man after my own heart. Oh wait, we haven't done the interview! And you're not gonna get to do the interview. Calm the fuck down. <laughs> Alright. It's been a long time since I last came here. This is where we honor the League Champions for all eternity. 
their courageous Pokémon are also inducted. Here, today, we witness the rise of a new League Champion, a trainer who feels compassion for and trust towards all Pokémon. A trainer who succeeded through perseverance and determination. I must say, though, I did like that he had a fortress and a... A Wobbuffet on his team, he was just missing three dragons. The new League Champion who has all the makings of greatness. Tegas, allow me to register you and your partners as champions. And there we go! We made it! I didn't think we would, we were like 10 levels under level. Dope! Suicune, Lantern, Cookie the Lantern, the third of Suicune. <laughs> Lullaby the Ampharos. Cheers again to Flappy Gold for that one, for that nickname. Venusaur, the, or Planter the Venusaur. <laughs> Verse the Espeon. And our starter, here with us to the end, Nunchaku the Meganium. Can't wait for you to learn Aura Sphere, buddy. <laughs> really can't. 197 Pokémon seen, 66 Pokémon owned. That's a lot of Pokémon owned, actually. 66 hours of playtimes, of course, that doesn't count. And that's it! That's it, guys. So I am just going to kind of hold down this button. And let this speed through. Are the... Are the icons... They changed the icons! Wait, they changed the Pokemon! Look, Diddle's a cube! How did they actually change the fucking outro? That's amazing! Jigglypuff is a fucking spark thing! Wait, that's great! I thought we were just gonna end this here. Okay, we are. But still, dope! What the fuck? That's that's actually cool, they ended the, the, the credits. Uh, okay, I had to press A. I nearly t closed the game right there. I'm back at home, right? Okay, back at home. And with that, guys, we're gonna save and leave off the episode there. Fuck, that was intense. We didn't lose a single mod. Damn, we didn't lose a single one. We kind of cheesed our way through the, 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 the Tyrannosaur, but that was about it, in fairness. We took- that was- that was intense. That was dope. That was- that was nice. Still disappointed in the no dragons fucking lands, but still. Okay, guys, on that note, we're gonna leave it there. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've been enjoying this, you know, this- this Nuzlocke, our first Nuzlocke here on the channel. Halfway to success, Ho and yeah, hope you'll join us for the next one.